The United States has added seven high-level North Korean officials and two entities to its sanctions list for human rights abuses. The North Korean leader's sister is among the people on the blacklist. Connie Kim with the details. The United States has slapped a fresh set of sanctions on seven North Korean officials and two agencies, including North Korean leader Kim Jong-un's sister Kim Yo-jong for human rights abuses. The Department of Treasury's announcement comes as the State Department released a report on the grave human rights violations in North Korea, calling the regime's human rights abuses among the worst in the world. The report said Pyongyang continues to commit extrajudicial killings, arbitrary arrest and detention with as many as 120,000 people, including children, in prison camps. The blacklist includes the Labor Ministry, State Planning Commission, Kim Yo-jung, who is a deputy head of the propaganda agency that engages in media censorship, and Kim Won-hong, who heads the state security ministry that engages in the inhumane treatment of detainees in prison camps. Under the new sanctions, U.S.-based property of individuals or agencies will be frozen and U.S. citizens will be banned from doing business with the listed individuals and entities. A State Department official reportedly said the U.S. does not expect the new sanctions or any aspect of Washington's policies to spur immediate change, but hope they'll bring modest effects. The U.S. has been upping the pressure on Pyongyang for its human rights violations, putting Kim Jong-un on its sanctions list for the first time in July. South Korea has welcomed Washington's latest move. Seoul's foreign ministry said such measures raise international awareness on the seriousness of North Korea's human rights situation and will contribute in bringing out stronger and specific moves to deal with the issue. Connie Kim, Item News.